Kirk Duckwell here with your Market Monday real estate stats for the Twin Cities area. Rates are making the market meter move again. What do I mean by that? We'll get into that in just one second. But first, make sure you click on that subscribe button. We know that knowledge is power, and the more knowledge that you have about our Twin Cities real estate market, the more that you can leverage the market to your advantage. So again, click on that subscribe button. Let's dive into the data. What's making the market move? Showings per listing per week did fall back over the previous week, which was at 4.01 down to 3.74, but that is still tracking ahead of last year by 5%. One of the big drivers right now, listings. So new listings tracking ahead by a much needed 23.6%. However, with the really low inventory and pending sales tracking ahead, that's bringing us down even more in total inventory, down 36.5%. Along with that, rates is a big driver. I'd like to welcome Chad Preby with Bell Bank Mortgage, a resident mortgage geek, here with some information on the rates. All right, rates are down. Freddie Mac is reporting rates down to 2.67. Not a lot to report today with the short holiday week. Market closes early on Thursday and close for the Christmas holiday on Friday. I do recommend if you're closing within 30 days to go ahead and get that rate locked in. Thank you, Chad. With all of this, the rates are really driving that market with it, falling back to where it was. That is moving our market meter overall and bringing it from a 7.15 up to a 7.25. So we can see we're actually still on the rise late season here, making it a pretty strong good seller's market for December. Where do I think this is going to go? I think the market meter is going to continue to rise and may flatten out briefly in January, but I don't think we're going to see much of a winter market. Hopefully you found this information valuable. As always, you can reach out with any questions. Take care, be safe, and have a great week.